Hi guys, so today I'm gonna do a review on Sony Wild CW Series laptop. And if you notice that the volume is really low, please turn up your volume so you can hear me better. Okay, let's get on with the review. Okay, over here we have the Sony Wild CW Series laptop. Uh, this is the front. This is the front. This is the right. This is the left. This is the back. So let's get on with the review. So at the back we have a DC in 19.5 volt and this part uh, over here this part is the 6 cell lithium ion battery it will last up to 4.5 hours and if you're a gamer it will probably last like half an hour or something a hardcore game and over here we have a ethernet port and a consistent lock on the left side of the laptop we have our fan vent, VGA port, HDMI port, this as you know it's 1980, 1920 by 1080, sorry for that. This iLink port is 400, this is two of the other high speed 2.0 USB ports. On the front we have a HG Duo port or a Magic Gate port as you can see and then SD card reader and on off teller battery teller if it's charging or not and the HDD spinner teller if it's spinning or use used and a wireless port this is really great if you want to save energy because if it's on on it's right now on on it will waste some of your battery but if it's on off it won't on the right side of the laptop we have a DVD burner and a reader and the CD reader and the burner. This is really great. And we have a headphone jack, microphone jack, and the last um, high speed USB port. So over here we have the Sony Wire laptop opened up, and and let's get on with the review inside. This laptop comes with Intel Core i5, running at 2.4 gigahertz. Turbo boost up to 2.93 gigahertz. Really good if you're a 3D, if you're using 3D's Max or you're a gamer. Over here we have Windows 7, um, Energy Star, and my official warranty. Mine came with three years of warranty, so pretty great. This is a Sony Chiquit style keyboard. It's not copied out of a Mac. Seriously, get a life. Just kidding. And the reason why I have icons right there because we imported from Saudi Arabia and that's why over here we have the three new buttons one is assist display off and wire just power it up and then I'll show you what it looks like once it's powered up just press assist and you should see this pop-up window just press yes and this will come up while you care. Once it's loaded, this is how it will look. So there's one click care, troubleshooting, recovery and restore, wire support. And then we have the display off. You use display off so you can display off your laptop screen. So you can listen to the music without wasting any um and battery life or something like that that's how I heard and once you press wire a uh, media gallery will pop up the color screen will be gone and the media gallery will appear something like that so you basically go like that click it and like that then it organizes just press that and there and then the next thing with come this laptop comes with is 4GB TDR 3 RAM right here. Let's go to CPU Z and I'll show you. So once you're there, let it load. Okay, so this comes with Intel Core i5 520M. As you can see, it's 20 32 M nm technology. Sorry if you're hearing me only on the left side of your speaker because I'm talking left on the left side of the speaker. So yeah. And this is crazy. Um, the, you can see my score speed right now. It's overclocking. 
2793.8 megahertz and you can see the bus speed so and it this comes with two cores and four threads let's go to mainboard as you can see it's marvelous wire let's go to memory as you can, I told you it's DDR3 RAM 4096 megabytes channel do and yeah graphics as you can see the technology is 40 nanometer and this size is 512 megabyte pretty good for me and then 3d application you go right there and that's about it and if you get, if you want to see the screen resolution it's 1600 by 900 yep and thanks for watching my video and goodbye Remember to subscribe, rate, and comment.